Startling new details have emerged about how Ray Gunn was able to qualify for the Paris Olympics. Conspiracy theories that Ray Gunn rigged the qualification process have been disproven. But fellow breakdancer Leah Clark has now revealed new details about how and why the selection pool was so shallow. Clark told The Guardian Australia that Ray Gunn qualified fair and square, but suggested she wasn't competing against the best breakers the country has to offer. According to Clark, the Oceania qualifying event took place too soon after it was advertised, meaning some breakers didn't even know it was happening, claiming there wasn't even enough B-girls to fill the top 16. Clark also revealed breakers wanting to take part in qualifying had to register with three different organisations just to try out, and they also had to have a valid international passport. That meant a number of breakers weren't willing or able to fork out the money with no guarantee they'd be heading to Paris. Clark added that the fallout from Ray Gunn's performance has really affected her and other breakdancers. She said, how do I go to work now and try to get our sponsorship and get our grant money for breaking programs for a sport that's just been made a mockery of? And how do we go out and represent our country at other world level events when Australia has been made a fool of? This is actually affecting us on a much larger scale than just memes.